<laughs> Y'all wanna say all crazes to Yahweh, Ba Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba Hashem, Rakach, Wadash. Brock at the Yahweh, Brock at the Yahweh Shai, Brock at the Rakach, Wadash. Double honors to the apostles, a great millstone. Woo, we out here on Labor Day, boy. Hey, where's that dictionary? Look at the word labor in that one. Hey, we laboring. Trash ass Labor Day. What was you looking up? You want to hold that? That's an old dictionary too, though. I think this one's from 1980 or something. Actually, the older dictionaries be better. The new ones, they don't like, they don't put it, like as much care in them, you know what I mean? Everything's just a product nowadays. Old, the new dictionaries be all poor quality, fall apart easy. What did I say? I was going to look up labor. Nice page you pick over time, they still stay in their place. You got some references? It's a nice. Let me read this real quick. Labor. Physical, physical or mental exertion of a practical nature as distinguished from exertion for the sake of amusement. Work for wages. Workers collectively. This, this ain't got the, uh, to strive painstakingly. To deal with exhaustive detail. Oh, this ain't got to fight. I had that other dictionary I had. It said, uh, uh, labor was like a painful. It was pretty much saying it was like slavery. I said, I know I should have that dictionary. Yeah, but Labor Day comes from what? Like 18, what was that, 1893 or something? Labor Day? Yeah. I've been seeing people get fucked up on them all the time, too. These things are annoying. They need to ban them shits. What the fuck is this line about here? Woo! This is driven again. Sharak 7 to 15, hate not labels work. Neither husbandry, which the most high have for gain. Oh, husbandry, that's a, a husbandry, that's an that's a old word for a farmer. Because right now, actually, we're, we're working in the fields out here. Whew. We sweating out here in the fields, boy. We come, out, we come out here, what? In the hot weather, in the cold weather. Like Nate and the IUIC, they only come out here if it's a perfect 72 degrees. <laughs> you know? Yep. Can't be no wind. <laughs> it's gotta be a perfectly still day. And then they'll come out and teach. Okay, okay. That's how a lot of dudes are. They won't go teach unless it's like a perfect day. If it's too hot, they won't go out. If it's too cold, they won't teach. If you it's know what Nate don't do, they go out when there's a, some type of like a nigga or somebody got caught killed by the cops or some shit. Yeah. You know, some, some a situation they can exploit. They're just trying to, yeah, exploit some shit, capitalize some shit. You know? But it says, hate not labor's work. Like, you know, holidays, they ain't coming out. Oh, hell no. They hate coming out on the holiday. They chilling on the holiday. Because that's their family to be That's their family to My family gets mad at me when they see me go teaching on uh, Labor Day. Or any holiday, especially Christmas. Yeah. Am I yet going out on Christmas? Okay. We've been out on Christmas. I'm around one day we was out teaching on the Super Bowl. The Super Bowl was going on, we was out teaching. Fucking Patriots. That's what it was, wasn't it? Trash ass Patriots. It was that one they won when the time they were the US was going into Afghanistan. Not Afghanistan, but it was a big war, they was going into somebody, it was bombing somebody. What time was it? I can't remember. Be honest. Right. Big news either. Afghanistan. Right. Going over. 
These damn years just all flow, they, fly, they just fly by. I can bullshit, man. Shit, I can't even tell you who won the last five Super Bowls. I'd have to think about it. For real. You gotta get faded up. That's the style, all, all the women getting their side of their head shaved. That's crazy. Yeah. And it's up. I got Sirach 11 and 20. I'm gonna skip around. It says, be steadfast in thy uh, covenant and be conversant therein and wax old in thy work. Wax old? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Continue to be doing the work, man. Especially people constantly seeing you out here, man. They like, damn. When the, when, when, when the destruction coming y'all talking about? Y'all been out here all that time. How many times we done heard that, man? Enough fucking time. Yeah. Like, my beard been turning gray over the years. Right. You ain't lying all this time, man. It's yeah. funny as fuck. <laughs> but it's funny, though, man. We ain't have no gray at first. <laughs> Ancient times. I mean, look at these fools in the world. They go out into the club like once a week. Something That's their church. You know, we go to, we come out here. This is fun. I mean, what else? You need to do something like this. We're going out here. It's like we pretty much rebellion against this world. You know what I mean? That's a fine part of the club. Yes. Fuck all that. Coming out here is fun though. Living in West and North, the Sawmill and Bethel. To be honest with you, I like battling people. I like it when people come up here and talk running their mouth. To me, that's a good time to be, you know? Because that proves that uh, you do all that studying. Now you be like, who wants a shot at the title? You know? Because really, the description say contempt for the face, right? So we ain't doing all this work for nothing. You just want to sit and study at home and then keep all that knowledge to yourself. What's the point? Why even study? You want to give an example like that with the ones that you gave talents to and so on? Yeah. Right. Um. And then after you go teaching the first time, that was all it took. He's like, oh, I'm hooked now. Can't stop. I know you probably have one of them experiences when we first went out teaching. Some crazy shit went down. And he's like, oh. I made that one bitch cry. I was on the other side. Remember that bitch with skateboard? Remember Campus. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey. The thick bitch? Yeah. 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 They feel pretty good. That's my first experience. Yeah, right. Yeah, well, yeah, once you see the... Uh, once you see that power, you want to see it again and again. You get hooked. You can't stop. That tells you why dudes that ain't don't keep going out teaching that they ain't did nothing. He's talking about she love proverbs. I can't even remember to be honest with you. I slightly remember it. What's up? That's your girl. Sharon two eleven for the Lord is full of compassion and mercy, long suffering and very pitiful, and forgiving forgiving sins and saving the time of affliction. Woe be to the fear for hearts and faint hands and the sinner that goeth into the ways. Woe unto him that is faint hearted, for he believeth not. Yeah, faint. Yeah, Trent. Oh, that little guy was out there with us. Remember, he was out there. Not ain't knocking him, but kind of 
But he was out there though. But he was like he didn't want to be out there. He was yeah, never yeah, enthused yeah, about it. Yeah. Well, we out here cussing people out. Ah, ah. We was going crazy. He just over there chilling. So we'll pick him up. Not even ready. Here, ready no, he, he know we coming too. I began ready the night before. You know. <laughs> But I mean, what else you gonna do? I mean, with your loser trash ass life. I mean, this life is trash. It's the only thing that, that has any value. Is doing this work, coming out here teaching. They're trying to get their life back. Oh, uh, get what life back? <laughs> she laughed at that one, see? That's something to laugh at. What kind of life you got in this trash ass world? This world is fucking trash. My whole, week, my whole week is miserable. Every week, miserable. Mondays, fucking, uh, like, the, we come out here on Mondays. It's a, the best day of the week. Tuesday's miserable. Every day's goddamn miserable. It's John 6, and uh, 50, oh, it's not, uh, 63, it says, it's not 63, it's, not, it's 67. It says, then said you have a shot into the 12. Will you also go away? Matter of fact, I'm gonna start up a little bit just so you can you know, get the point. It says, he said, therefore said, matter of fact, I'm just gonna say it, just the same time. <laughs> you know, this one, you have a shot, I was talking about, you know, eat my bread, eat my, uh, my yeah. flesh, and drink my blood. We got all day. Oh, yeah. Hey, man, look, we got quiet out, it's quiet out here today. Yeah. You take your time with it. Okay. It says, uh, uh, this is John 6. The point is 63, but I'm just gonna read that 50. Because this is the bread which come came down from heaven, that as your father did eat manna and are dead, he that eat it from this bread shall live forever. <laughs> Armor of the Lord, he's that bread that came down from heaven. Just like at the Last Supper. He said, Well, you gotta eat my flesh and drink my blood. And remember we did that Hebrew video and we went to the word Bethlehem. And the word Bethlehem means house of bread. That's that that's that bread of heaven. The Lord gonna feed you. This is the house of bread, actually. Right here. The house of David. Where is David from? Bethlehem. The Lord is from Bethlehem. Well, he was born in Bethlehem. <laughs> it says these things said. Yeah, that's that bread. Not no stale moldy bread either. Like a lot of y'all got, they got that moldy bread. You know, we go get a piece of bread, got mold on. You're like, damn. Their bread, their eyes, what Jake called it, money. So it was fake shit. Oh you yeah. Know what I'm he says, these things said he in the synagogue as he taught in uh, Cor 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 okay. uh, Corsonium. We need their uh, Capernaum. We need their four of his disciples when they uh, have heard these things. Said, this is a hard saying. Who can bear it? It says, when Yahushua knew it in himself that his disciples murmured at him, he said unto them, Doth this offend you? What? And if he, if he see, he shall say. He shall see the Son of Man sent up where he was before. The spirit that quickened it, the flesh prophet. They said where he was before. What does that mean? You know what I mean? Where was he before? Because they said too, the bread came down from heaven. It says, The words that I speak unto you, they are life. Oh, these words are life. Oh, my fault. It is still his life, though. Yeah, Doesn't yeah. say life, too, though, yeah, don't it? Yeah, yeah. They yeah. said, uh, which, like, like you said, this is, we live in a life, this is life right here, this is life and uh, life more abundant. You know what I'm saying? We're just going to leave to the kingdom. And that's why the Lord, too, said what? He that loves his life shall lose it, but he that hates his life shall gain eternal life, or something like that. He says, but there are some of you, uh, like, but there are some of you that believe not. We have shot new from the beginning who they were that believe not and who should betray him. And he said, therefore said I unto you, that no man can come unto me except they were given unto him of my father. From that time, many of the disciples went back and walked no more with him. Then said, Yeah, hey, well, hold on, read that part again. What did I say? From that time, many of the disciples. Now, right before that, though. Oh, so like, and therefore, I said unto you, that no man can come unto me except they were given unto him of my father. Say, no man can come unto me except it was given to him by the father. Go ahead. From that time. From that time, many of the disciples went back and walked no more with him. Hey, you see that? At that time, when he said that, because he also said that 
He knew who was the chosen before from the beginning. Everything is predestined. So that messed them so much up in the head so much they just stopped following him. And that's why people still today they get mad when you say only the the Lord's only dealing with the elect. Like you got a lot of Israelite groups, they get mad if you say the Lord's not gonna save all of Israel. They get mad at that. They're like, oh, they fuck y'all fucked up. Y'all ain't trying to bring everybody together. Everybody trying to talk about we supposed to all uh, have unity. Says, uh, Hold that. Let me read this 370. Go with that. 15, John 15 and 16. For ye have not chosen me, but have chosen you. And ordained good. you that ye should good. go forth and bring forth fruit, and that your fruit should remain, that whatsoever, whatsoever ye shall ask of the Father in my name, he may give you. Yep, so you, you, can't, you can't choose the Lord. But you know, if people be in church, they're like, ow, oh, I, I accepted Jesus in my heart today. But the scriptures don't say that. They don't say you can accept anything. You gotta be accepted. You gotta be chosen. You gotta be found worthy. Exactly. Shit. Like you could just like you get to choose. Like it was your choice. And the church take everybody in, man. Homosexuals. Everybody, man. Drug dealers. I know a church where there's a gay pastor. Whew. Yeah. Lesbians too. Lesbian pastors too. That's obviously against the Bible. So they're not following the Bible. No, definitely not. The scriptures say homosexuals gotta get put to death. I said the Holy Bible. That's what the Holy Bible says. Homosexuals should be put to death. You know, I don't need the Bible to believe in that one. I like it. Right. I mean, I can get the scripture if you want to hear the scripture. That day's coming when the Lord gonna kill him. You ain't gotta physically do it, but that day coming when the Lord gonna kill him. I mean, they'll kill themselves when they catch AIDS. No, they're going to mission and spread that shit. Yeah, they're spreading it too. Hey, I'll read that. Man, these bitches nowadays, they, yeah, right, they're giving it away. They're giving it away. It's a fine ass bitch, man. They call them back page, man. Fine ass black bitch. Fine as fuck. A mission to kill everybody. Oh, they leaving. I ain't reading that. Go ahead. I'm reading the faggot scripture. I get it. Leviticus 20 and 13. If a man also lie with mankind as he lieth with a woman, both of them have committed an abomination. They shall surely be put to death. Their blood shall be upon them. Like, we don't know. You know, the faggot, but he denied that. He even condemned that. Does he know it's wrong? Yeah. Jacob, yeah, that's true. Like Alex Jones. You know he came out there. I seen the video, man. He was the. I seen the video. He's like, he's like, there's two type of people: those who watch porn and those who say they don't watch it. <laughs> and then he was like, oh, that was a, that was an advertisement, bro. It was open up on one of his tabs. He tried to say he, he it was an ad or something. I mean, it was clearly his tab were open. You know when you click your tabs, you can see all your tabs. He was on a tranny site. <laughs> he might as well just admit he was watching it. They, people respect him more for that. That would get the left wingers on his side. Shit. Look at this motherfucker. Little ass guitar. Playing a ukulele. We're going into the labor, the work. It don't matter, just read it. Uh, uh, boy, I remember what this is. It's a patience. I can chunk it up. Peter's response. It says, uh. I'll see, they show you the. What are you showing, uh, six? Yeah. They show you how some of them lost patience, right? Right? They said they stopped following the Lord. There's more. Go ahead, though. Also go away. Then Simon Peter answered him, Lord, to whom shall we go? That has the words of eternal life. Ooh, that's a fire scripture. Right, like where else are we gonna go? Here it is, we got the words of eternal life. Where is where where are you gonna go after that? What's better than that? So you a damn fool if you stop doing this work, actually. What the hell? It says if we believe in our shore. We are sure. We believe and we are sure. 
And that's all, homie. Right. And that ark, the Messiah, the son of the living God. Shirak 22 and 14. Woe unto you yeah. that have lost patience. And what will you do when the Lord shall visit what, you? What number was that? Shirak 2. So, woe unto you that have lost patience. We're right back in the world, man. I got to give me a good paying job. Go get married, have children. Yeah. Build up my bank account. We're going to get that shit. Make that cheddar. But denying the Lord. Check your face. Second, second Peter 2. Second Peter 2 and 2. It's in there somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Motherfuckers that's going to. That, that know the truth. Let's go back to the world. on you sometimes. Well, you know? it's too late now for a lot of them, man. They, they got that taste of the world again and they ain't escaping that shit, man. They, 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 can, uh, they can measure the two now. What does the and world ain't the Them niggas kept bothering me and studying. They was going out every week. I tell you, they was never in the truth. Right. Dude, I hate this motherfucking world. I don't know how you could ever want to be part of this shit. This shit is fucking trash. Hey. It's it is polluted. Uh, so 2 Peter 2 and 19. While they promised them liberty, I'm sorry, 18. Uh, but when they speak great sort of words of vanity, they are lured with the lust of flesh, of the flesh, uh, through much wantonness, and those that were clean escaped from them to the hair. Oh, yeah, I see one of your boys from the, uh, like the, what's that, the Israel tried and refined? They were just trying to do a little rap thing, but they, I, I heard that one of the top the top guys disappeared. He gone. No, not dead. I, he's just where is he? Yeah. Yeah, he won't be a rapper. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's really a lot of Jakes. They get in the truth because they failed rappers. The rap career failed them. They met the boy from the Dallas game. They was chasing down Oh, uh, uh element. Yeah, he said he, 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 he didn't he call he was talking to Alex Jones. And he was like cussing out Alex Jones, but at the same time trying to get a job with him. <laughs> and Alex Jones clowned his ass. He's like, dude, what you want a job? You know? Still never got a job. <laughs> Still ain't came back in the truth. I heard Alex Jones is a terrible person to work for. I was reading all the dirt on him, boy. You know, he greedy. You don't want to pay nobody. You don't want to share, share the love. Yeah, hey, your boy Element, bro. And I seen him doing some music on the YouTube video. That shit was trash, trash, trash. Element, yeah. But now his real name was uh, his Hebrew name was uh, he had some crazy ass name. I forget it was some long ass name. Look at that shit. He was right there with Alex and Jones trying to kiss Alex Jones' ass. Yeah. On camera. I'm, I've been trying to get a hold of y'all for a long time. And hey, that was a good video though. That was with the devil worshiping abortionists. That was a classic. This time Alex got a song too. Oh yeah. Seventy-six. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, Alex, man, we're giving you all kind of play with this one. That was probably one of his last good videos. To be honest with you, he done fell off. Ever since he had that, ever since that Trump shit and that Roger Stone weirdo came on there. By they promised them liberty, them they themselves are the surface of corruption. For of a womb of man is overcome, of the same as he brought in bondage. For if after they have escaped the pollutions of the world through the knowledge of the Lord and Savior, you have shot. Why? 
kind of like that. Yeah, we like Donald Trump. He's going to help bring in the kingdom of heaven. Make sense, Michael. Michael, 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 They hate it when you say that, don't they? Like, what? Some people try to fight you if you say you like Donald Trump. They always like the wrong president. They escaped the pollutions of the world. Through the knowledge of the Lord and saving Yahweh Shai, they are again entangled therein and overcome. The latter end is worse than with them in the beginning. Where it had been better for them not to have known the way of righteousness, and after they have known it, to turn from the holy commandment live unto them. But what's the scripture saying what's gonna happen to him? But it is happening unto him according to the truth of Proverbs. The dog is turned to his vomit again. And so that was washed to her wall in the mire. He said it's better for them to not have known the truth. It's better that they have not be one of these niggas walking around being a, a nigga. They not have known the truth. Now they're gonna get their ass whooped even worse, man. These motherfuckers just fell out. That's why them demons start fucking with you, bro. You, you, got, you got cursing demons out. You got under. Yeah, because you know, man, the most high gonna fuck you up. You don't want that asshole. I ain't trying to get fucked up. And you know, some of the motherfuckers who fell out got children too. They gonna watch their children suffer. <laughs> Shit. You know? And they read the scriptures, man. They hear about all the, what the scriptures. They talk about the, uh, the calamities that the scriptures have done. Especially when the one when it says, when you, you, they get the chip of 14. Yeah. They're going to get hit with fire and you know, the on and you know, the curses or whatever. They'll just get, they start trying to justify that shit. Like, oh, that chip, the chip ain't really the mark of the beast. And... Well, personally, that's just a scary thought to me. That's a horrible fucking, that's a nightmare for your ass. That's why these scary movies ain't scary to me, man. But you think about an ass with the most high, give your ass? No. Mm -hmm. That's a nightmare. Oh, shit, I got a script for that. Here you go. The same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of the Most High, which is poured out without mixture into the cup of his indignation. And he shall be tormented. And it's the same thing with the niggas that fell out. Same same thing gonna happen. Well, you know what? The ones that fell out gonna receive the chip. <laughs> and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the man. Yeah, you got a lot of groups saying the mark of the beast is not the chip. So they open up, they make it have an opening to say it's okay to take the chip. That's crazy. Because they'll they, they be like, well, it's not ascended. If it's not the mark of the beast, if it's not the mark of the beast, I guess it's okay to take it. That's a hell of an ass with the people for saying that shit. Well, there's a Deliver, lot. Delivering people to the chip. I would say most Israelite groups teach that the mark of the beast is not the chip. Most groups teach that. Sure. The only group I know, great most of the only people I know to teach it is the chip. Maybe GOCC, but they so bugged out. Most groups teach that Market of Beast is like a sin or something. Oh, you I see. Oh, what the fuck is that in a market? Oh, I mean, he's a detective, though. He's a fucking cop. What do you expect? He probably already got the chip. Shit. You a police officer or a fucking detective? Is he still a detective? I don't know. It's like you an actual detective, an actual cop, but you're fighting against the oppressor. That don't even make no sense. Does not the scripture say do not go to the law before the unjust? I don't even make no sense. I don't even make no sense at all. That's the biggest red flag I've ever seen in my life. Could you imagine what would happen if one of us found out we was a detective? Yeah. Especially if I was a oh, he's got me eat him while he's a cop. Could you imagine even one of the elders of GMS so they got find out they was a detective? It'd be the end of it. They never hear the end of it. For some reason Nate get a pass. And no wonder he's got he's he keeps uh, uh tabs on his congregation. He be while uh, reading people's emails and shit. He, he got he he's a detective. That's what he's good at. Surveillance and motherfucker. Yeah, it's crazy. Where in the scriptures to say to use a social security number? Cause you got a lot of uh, churches do that. They get all your information, take your social, 
Like, why do you need that information? It's really, you know, the social security number, uh, that's a precursor to the market of beasts. That's pretty much what the market of beasts is going to be, but implanted in you, all that, all them numbers. And how many numbers is the social security, uh, what, nine numbers? Ain't that nine numbers? Hold up. Am I retarded? One, two, three. Yeah, hey, not nah, yeah, nine number. Nine's like the that's a satanic number. Nine. Yeah. Thirteen. Well, they say nine's a magic number. It's an upside down six. Which four is the thirteenth floor they don't have again? Thirteen. Yeah. We saw superstitious and shit. They say it's because they got the front the ninth Templar got burned at the stake. On Friday the 13th. And then all these buildings are built by Masons. But they all come from the Nice Templar. That's their order. Oh, shit. And they found out that Nice Templar was worshiping Baphomet. And so King Philip of France executed them. And then they make up lies. They say King Philip was just killing them to steal their money. You know that's some bullshit. He killed them because they was worshiping the devil. They call him Philip the Fair. It's all humidity, boy. Go ahead, you got something? Go ahead. 12 to 46. What if that servant would come? Like, for example, that servant would do his Lord's will and prepare not himself. Did according to his will shall be beaten with many stripes. Yeah, you will be beaten with many stripes. So you gotta prepare yourself. Let I mean, everything go together because you gotta prepare yourself like we know that chip's coming. You gotta get your mind right. Things that fell off, you, you know, you knew that chip was the beast. Since you wanna uh, act like you don't know, you're gonna get beat even worse. You yep. don't know. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because if you right, if you know something. That's even worse if you didn't know. Make sure they can be as many as they have to. If he that do not, if they commit things worthy of stripes, shall be beaten with these stripes. For unto whosoever much is given of him shall be much required into what was wrong. I love the scripture here, that stripes. Yeah, stripes. 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 Right. Like you gonna get actual stripes on your back <laughs> when they done with you, you know? That's wild, man. <laughs> Grown ass man gonna get the ass pulled. Like what's that other scripture? <laughs> a rod for the back of a fool? Yeah, yeah, a proverb. Is a proverb? Mm -hmm. Proverbs or Ecclesiastes? Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. Men have committed much of him; they will ask the Lord. Proverbs 1 and 7. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom and instruction. Falling out. The ones that lost patience, they despise the Lord. So they did not choose the fear of the Lord. They did not choose. They did not have pleasure in the fear of the Lord. And the funny thing, though, is really when you look at it, there really ain't no choice. Like where the Lord said, I've chosen you. You have not chosen me. That's true. There you go. You get bugged out thinking about that. Right, right, right. Hey, look at this. Da Daniel uh, 12 and 1. And that time shall Michael stand up, the great prince, which all oh, Jehovah Witness down there, they're going to say Michael is uh, the Lord himself. You know that's what they teach, right? Yeah. They bugged out. Prick. They say, oh, he's the prince. I see. No, Michael's an archangel. At that time shall Michael stand up, the Michael great prince. Oh, they gonna show up all right. <laughs> Mike, Michael, Euro, right, right. Gabriel. You know that was supposed to be my birthday. Euro, Michael. Michael. That's a, I mean, that's one of the most popular names. Michael is? Yeah. I mean, Michael, you know, all kind of Michael. Michael. What's up, Aaron? Was. Aaron? Yeah. I ain't met him yet. Hey, Aaron. Yeah, what's up, Aaron? I always felt weird as a kid. I was like the only Aaron. I knew one other Aaron. My, I had this one teacher call me Aaron. 
Yo, A A Ron. Hi. Let's go with you. Lobster, shrimp, catfish. You can read a. You got a Bible, right? Get a. Open up Leviticus, the 11th chapter. Leviticus, the 11th. Then it goes through all the different uh, foods you can eat. Dietary. Dietary. Okay. Yep. What, what's your nationality? You black? No mother and father. Right. She's she probably a, um, a Levite anyway. Yeah, because the tribes are scattered. You're probably a Levite. You're probably a Levite. Yeah, Leviticus 11. You. Your dad. Your father. Levites. Okay. Because act, actually, Genesis 50 said Levi. What it said is habitations are cruel and it'll be scattered within the other tribes for a cruel cruelty. Him and send me a one. Send me a man weapon for my cruelty. Yeah. That's the scripture, something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah, yeah drug you motherfuckers. Oof. Really, I want to try this. Benjamin is the freak tribe. Benjamin is raping motherfuckers. Wait, all, all of Israel got problems. Oh, all of them true. <laughs> yeah. I got problems. That tribe of Judah. Judah oh, Benjamin and Levi. <laughs> Yo motherfuckers ain't shit. But Judah was the one that brought the word out first. Yeah. Judah still a fucking retard. Yeah, you know. Judah's yeah. stupid. How we get in that too? That's the thing. Judah's stupid. Judah's stupid. Yeah. Judah's dumb. Well, at least the majority of them. Yeah. The, the other one are fucking geniuses. Yeah. One third. Yeah, right. Yeah. I make mean, some of the some of the top scientists in the world have been Judas though. You know? Judas, Judas. Yeah, place. Ah oh, shit. I, I got a problem with that battery. I got another battery.